Hey, welcome back everybody. Uh, today I was going to do another uh, So Bad It's Good episode, but instead, something so much better has dropped into our lap. See, me, I'm a, I'm an art connoisseur. I'm a... And, you know, there's nothing I love more than modern art. I mean, is there anything better than modern performance art? I'm I'm really asking, like, I, I don't know. I've been locked in this uh, in this room for 17 years and they won't let me out and they only play me modern performance art. I, I am unaware of anything else in the outside world. But uh, apparently uh, the one of the aides or staff members of Hillary Clinton is a, a real amazing artist, okay? And, uh, and one of her videos of her performance art that she has shown Hillary Clinton and Anthony Weiner has uh, surfaced as part of a, of an email leak, and I think that, I mean, after uh, reviewing Gear Mankind's video, I don't think there's anyone more qualified to criticize it than me. Okay, so let's with no further ado, let's uh, let's play this shit. Okay, Marina Abramovich, uh, Spirit Cooking, 1997. It, it's vintage. 97 was a good year for performance art. Okay, here we go. This is, uh, you know, it's tomato sauce, probably. You know, I, I, I'm reading people on Twitter saying that this is, uh, menstrual blood, and I, and I ask myself, um, how do you, uh, get 10 gallons of menstrual blood? Like, where did she acquire this? Okay, uh, mix fresh breast milk with fresh sperm. Mmm. Delicious. You know, that's how I make my uh, mascarpone. That's how I cook it. You know, the the best part of this is this is some kind of uh, satanic ritual, but uh, she looks like a an aging, depressed uh, middle school teacher. Like the gla I mean, if you're gonna if you're gonna write satanic incantations on the wall. At least rest the part, you know. Put some feathers in your in your hair. Uh, shove a live mongoose up your ass. Something. You really, really just commit. So, you know, I I really hope this is her actual house. Like uh, years later, the place still smells like her pussy, and she's like, "That this was a mistake." So, with a knife cut deeply into the middle finger of the left hand, eat the. Okay, so we cut away. I, I wonder what we'll eat. I'm, I'm sure it's eat the pain, eat the pain. Well, I'm. Can I eat the pain I'm, uh, I'm feeling while watching this shit? This is, this is nine minutes long. This is nine minutes long. Why? Why am I? Why am I doing this? Who is the guy who's helping her? Is this like her husband or a friend? She like uh, go up to her friend and like, Hey Dave, uh, you wanna you wanna help me do an art installation? Uh, yeah, sure, uh, Marina. What, what can what can I help you with? Uh, I need you to uh, hold a uh, a bucket of my menstrual blood. Could you could you do that? Could you could you be a buddy? Could you be a pal? You know her mom's gonna come back home and kill her. She, she did not tell her she's doing this. I love her man bun. She, she looks like a man. Just, just putting that out there. Spin around until you lose consciousness. Try to eat all the, I think, questions of the day that was. I'm not sure. I mean, you, you see lumps. I, I'm not sure what this is, but there, there's lumps in it, and people are saying that this is menstrual blood, or, or I'm like she must have some uh, some really heavy flow. Oh God, I love the guys on on the side, just sort of uh, sort of watching and reviewing this. One of them looks like uh, Superintendent Charles Charles from The Simpsons. He's like, uh, mm, yes, good blood, and. Uh, now she's, uh, she's ruining a perfectly good Chia pet. Oh, I, I didn't splash enough blood on him. I should, uh, should really get the, uh, get the brush and fix it. You know, the, you know, the, there are painters who, uh, just, you know, really get into the finer details. Like, 
paint perfect depictions of humans and then there's this chick who uh, gets a brush and she's like like she's on the same level their their art is on the same level her gently brushing menstrual blood on a uh <laughs> oh oh here we go and she i'm i'm just confused now Yeah, throw that blood, bitch. Is it wrong that this is turning me all and she missed? I mean, y y the great thing about uh, modern art performances is that you can see no one has practiced it. I mean, regular artists practice for years to perfect their craft. Modern artists, like, come up with a stupid idea in their head and then they show up at the at the day they're supposed to perform it and do it for the first time. Then they're like, uh... Yeah, this is this isn't working. The blood isn't sticking to the wall. I I guess I should have uh, should have tested it before we started. Uh, oops, oops! I uh, I missed uh, the doll. Uh, get get me a brush. I'll just kind of make it look like I hit. You know, you can you can tell she didn't plan any of this. She's like, uh, oh oh god, the reporters are still here. Uh, I guess I should uh, should do something else like the entire performance should have taken her like five minutes and then they're, they're all like staring waiting to see what she'll do next and then she's like uh, she comes up to her friends like hey you got any more ideas this this was it I didn't really in my head this looked like it would take like three hours but it's been three minutes and I'm, I'm out of ideas just just pour it on the corners just, just do, do it don't worry I, I have no idea what she's saying, but I'm guessing uh, she's uh, explaining her ideas for inter interior decorating, and her career did not uh, did not skyrocket after this. No one really wanted their house smelling like middle-aged pussy. And now we watch her awkwardly stare. You know, this could have been edited with some music to, to make it look actually artistic, but when you watch it, you see just a couple of awkward, incompetent people, just not really sure what they're supposed to do. They, they, have, they did not plan this well. Like, you know, they could she could have dressed up, they could have, like, had some epic Gregorian chants playing in the background, but instead she's uh, walking around in her... Uh, in her pajamas, I guess. Like this is, she clearly sleeps in this at night, and just kind of she she finished painting. She's not sure what to do now. Okay, I heard English words. Can I join now? She she joined the cooking club. I I'm not sure. They weren't impressed. I think. Imagine using her recipes to to cook. Something like hand someone a big bowl. Is is this uh, is this blood pudding? Uh, technically, put your hands up in the air and wave them like you just don't care. No, you have to you have to wave them. You have to no. You're you're doing it wrong. You have to. Okay. I, your face is like you don't care, but you have to actually wave them. You're you're not doing it. Can can you at least raise the roof a little bit? This was not part of the performance. She woke up like this, and her friends were like laughing their asses off. The, she's like, "Get this fucking snake off me!" Ha <laughs> ha! Look at her! Look at her! She's got the snake on. God damn it! Get the snake off of me! Don't get the camera! Don't get the God damn it! You know she was uh. Stuck there for several hours. Oh god, there's more to this. Is this part of the same performance? I mean, there's a drop of blood on the camera, and I don't think they planned it. I think she, they were just, like, too lazy to clean it up. And here is the staple of all performance art. Being really embarrassed by what you're doing and going to some abandoned buildings to do it. Like, they, they, want, well, they went to a place where there is no one. This is like a... This is like when Movie Bob films his uh, 
his idiotic videos. We're going to be talking about him at some point in the future. But you see that he's alone, that he put his camera on a tripod and the, that he has no friends. And this is sort of the same situation. They know what they're doing is not art. So they went to some abandoned buildings and they have no budget. They have no intention of putting any effort into this. And so they sneak into some abandoned ruins where no one can see them and uh, laugh at them. And by the way, I did read the sign. It's uh, I don't remember exactly what it says. It says something about pressing your face up against the stone and uh, transmitting with your brain. Imagine what this guy is transmitting with his brain. It's like sitting there thinking really hard. I need to buy more denim jackets. Did I shave today? Is it noticeable? Can everyone see my hairline receding? And uh, edited by Ethical Images Studio. In, in 2009? Two th 2000 how lazy are you she she recorded this in in 97 she waited 12 years with this garbage to have someone edit this Tw you know what i think the awkwardness went on for several days like this is she went she spent years in that room painting that shit and that's why it took so long to edit she started in 97 ended in uh, 2001 and then it just took years to edit down to this. I mean, it took three more years to watch it. And then, you know, it, you you watch it several more times while you edit. So there's this, this guy somewhere at this ethical studio. The studio shut down, but he's still there because he didn't know they, uh, they closed. And he's just there editing this one nine-year-long video. Anyways, that that's it for me. Um, vote Hillary Clinton.